Well, guys, welcome back to another episode. Me and Carlos are going to be uh, doing some detecting today to see what uh, we can recover. Uh, we're at a location today. Neither of us have been here before. Uh, we're only going to be here a couple hours. It is a Sunday afternoon. It's about 3, 3.30. So we don't have too long, maybe a couple hours before the sun goes down. And that's going to be it. So um, we're going to get right to it, guys, and we'll see you guys at the first find. Well, I've uh, decided to get started pretty early. Um, I'm just waiting for Carlos here for a couple minutes. Dug one penny, got another signal in this hole. Looks like I got myself a silver. I've only been here a couple of minutes. <laughs> That's a great way to start. Silver quarter right off the bat. Looks like a 1963. Young Elizabeth. Well, I'm presuming that this spot might have not been hit. This is a great start already. I've been here three minutes, five minutes max. I'm gonna keep moving here. I'm tempted to wait for him. I don't like to start before my uh, other diggers get here, but he insisted that I start because we don't have too much light going on. Anyway, let's keep moving. Here was a signal, it was coming up really good. Me and Carlos uh, both scanned it. It was coming up really high. So far we only have one silver. We've been here, uh, I don't know, about an hour, an hour and a half or so. This one might be as well. It's in the dirt right here. Let's see. It's not silver. I have no clue what this is. Hmm. I don't know. Relic, relic of some sort, who knows. But it wasn't silver, it was ringing really good. I'm gonna have to clean that up, get a toothbrush on it, and see if I can make anything out. Anyway, uh, light's fading here. I don't think we'll be uh, much more longer than an hour. So we're gonna keep moving on. Well, we're running out of light here. I had a pretty good signal. It wasn't ringing in the, the silver range. So I ended up digging the plug out and something big around popped out right there. Carlos is uh, providing the light. Let's see what this is. There's a hole through it. I think it's a pin, I don't think it's a coin. And it doesn't look old. You guys can see right there, 1967. Hmm. It's uh, something commemorative for sure. You guys can see right there, there's a crown just at the top. There's a shield here. So Carlos is gonna clean it up and then uh, we'll get back to you in just a second. That's really nice. That's a commemorative token. I don't have one of these. Want to flip it? It's got a hole in it. Looks like the date's over here. 18, 1867 over there. It looks like it says Confederation right here. And then uh, 1967 right in here. That's a nice score. Just before we're heading out. That's really cool. Anyway, uh, we won't be here too much longer. Another 10, 15 minutes and we'd be out of here. Anyway, let's keep moving. We'll see if we can get anything else. Well, as you guys can see, it's pretty dark out here. Um, I think I got a silver. I had to move my plug over to the concrete here, but I think I got a silver right in there. It was coming up really good, and it is. It's a young Elizabeth. Check the date on it. 1960. That's sweet. Carlos has a headlamp. Unfortunately, I did not bring mine. I didn't expect to be out here at night. Um, but there is a light close by, and he's not too far away. So there you go. Here's another silver quarter for the day. Now, a couple of items that I did find. One was an old buckle. And another one was um, a brass O-ring with a bit of a connection to it. It... It looked almost looked like a rain sky, but it almost 
At the same time, it almost looked like something you'd find on furniture, like an old piece of furniture. So if we get a minute, we'll have a look at that, but I don't think we're going to have chance to do a bit of a wrap up today. But there you go. There's a silver. I'm going to see if we can find some more silver before we leave. Let's keep moving. Well, I'm just doing a along the edge here. Um, I'm going to be going uh, along here uh, and this way. Ended up getting a middle, I don't know, like a mid-tone, something like that. Ended up pulling out a musket ball right in there. It's a lead one. This has been too many signals. A lot of big trees around where I am right now. So I'm just going pretty slowly around there and hopefully I can get something. But there you go. That was a mid-tone musket ball. Cool. Let's keep moving. Not too many coins. No silver. Not yet. Alrighty, folks. So here we are. The Jasonator. He has something in the hole. He says he's silver. So let's watch this. I really don't know what he's going to get here. And seeing as it's... Uh, that's not a good sign. Yeah. That's not a good sign, but I don't think that's it. And seeing as it's, I don't know, the 4th, 5th of December? I don't even know what day it is. 4th. But this makes 12 months this year I get out digging. Gotta love it. Look right here. Yeah. Yeah. Let's bring it out and have a look at it. Don't know what it is yet. Oh! Oh! Look what it is. Well, I can't see. You tell me. It's a Merc. Wow. Nice. How sweet is that? I've got three bottle caps I can trade you for. It. Three bottle caps? Yep. I'll think about it. 41. These are really nice coins. That is very sweet. Go. Yep. All right. There you go, guys. Well, there's that old swing set I was talking about. Looks like it's just been dumped in here at some point. It's been here a while, look at that. The tree's actually grown around the around the slide. That's pretty neat. So it's definitely been here a while. The spot we're hitting today, it used to be a really old racetrack. Maybe. Really? I miss that sucker. <laughs> but you know what? You it's got. It's worth missing. It's nothing special. Yeah, but still. The ring is ring, though, I guess. Cool. That's nice. It's not gold. Nope. Is that the local newspaper calling you already? Yeah, it's a junker, but still. It's nice. Yeah. Copper? Yeah, bro. That's what I was hitting at? Yeah. That's all right. Just as we're ending the dig. I'm done, bud. Yeah, me too. It's hot. It, it, so. It's hot. <clears throat> yeah. It's hot, sweaty, muggy. I think we're done for the day. Just underneath those bushes. Just You see where it curves off? Just underneath that <clears throat> yeah. bench there. What'd you get? I ended up getting this. Oh, what is that? That's what I thought. I thought it was the handle off an old uh, shaver at one time. Yeah. <clears throat> but if you screw off the back, there mm. looks like another little screwdriver inside. So it looks like there's a screwdriver. Yeah, look at the end of it. It, it does. It narrows down. Yeah. Almost like a flathead. Yeah. So the end comes out, does it? Does it unscrew? Yep. Oh, yeah. So maybe the tip goes in there, eh? To exchange the tips. Yeah, that's a, that's an older one. Yeah, it looks let's 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 see the end of this. Yeah, you can tell by the end of that. Yeah, this it was that's got a screwed every one time. Got a little age to it. I I think it's pre nineteen. It's before nineteen seventy, I think nineteen eighty. That's like brass in there. Yeah, it's still pretty clean on that end. I'm guessing maybe fifties, sixties maybe. Yeah. Yeah.
Could be wrong. That's a good find. And a ring too to end the day. Awesome.